A warning now from the Waukesha County Sheriff's Department. You will see slower response times to non-emergencies. The department is restructuring, attempting to avoid layoffs because of a budget deficit. Fox 6's Brett Lemoyne joins us live now with a peek at the internal conversations within the department and why county leaders question an inspector's math. Yeah, that's right, Stephanie. Fox 6 obtained a copy of this email through an open records request. In that email and through the county's response, it highlights a debate going on about public safety and your tax dollars. In a staff email sent earlier this month, Deputy Inspector Patrick Esser warned of staffing changes and potential layoffs over the holidays because of a $250,000 budget deficit. Esser writes, we have not received enough money to do the job next year the same way we are this year. Administration expects the shortfall as part of its current $46.6 million budget. Quote, all of that means we need to look at different ways to do our job within the budget given to us by the county. Starting September 5th, the department reduced the number of deputies assigned to specific districts to, quote, new minimums. Four deputies on first and second shifts and five overnight. Some day parts, it could be half the staff they had before. Esser continues, it should be noted that the public may see longer wait times for non-emergency response. We are fully aware and expect this to some degree. We asked County Executive Paul Farrow's office about the claims in the email. A spokeswoman told us, quote, when the county executive introduces his 2023 budget, the sheriff's department will receive the single largest investment of new tax levy in any department in at least the last 20 years. Since Farrow's first budget in 2016, the spokeswoman says, quote, the sheriff's department has received roughly the same amount of new tax dollars as the departments of emergency preparedness, health and human services, public works, circuit courts, and the district attorney's office combined. She notes the sheriff's department also received the vast majority of new levy funds in last year's budget. While the sheriff asks for more, the county says it's getting plenty. Now, the chair of the Judiciary and Law Enforcement Committee here in Waukesha County says they will be talking about this very topic at their meeting tomorrow morning. The committee hasn't even seen the budget for 2023 yet. County Executive Paul Farrell will present it to the county board in about two weeks. We did reach out to the spokesperson here at the Sheriff's Department for an interview for this story. We were told no one was available. Reporting live in Waukesha, Brett Lemoyne, Fox 6 News. All right, Brett, thank you.